Welcome back, YouTube community. We are going to go, go she go. Let's check out this bundle of joy. We got some green, whatever the hell they are. I don't really know. Nor do I really want to know. Hey there. You're looking a bit more evil than normal, Yoshi. I mean, look at that mouth. Some sort of sadistic psychopath smile. And smile this, Yoshi. You're only good for doing one thing. And that's dying. So go off the deep end and die, you mother... Mm. Yeah, you know where that's going. Oh, and... Here we are in a cave... Of no importance. So it's time to leave the cave and get to that midpoint and watch him, watch him go by. Whatever. Bye, Yoshi. Bye, suicidal toy. Prove that it's not made out of, you know, like. Yeah, you have to prove that Yoshi is a biological animal. I don't really believe that he is. That's totally not worth it either. We're going to, uh... We're gonna raid it out here. The idea that, um... Hitting on a hundred pounds can make you, like, float in the air is... Kind of an interesting theoretical concept in physics. And they will probably develop it sooner or later in the real world. And hey, he looks kind of interested in the ground there. The world's greatest archaeologist. Those Random spider thingies. Pokies? Yeah, I know. Those are the desert things with spikes on them. But how fun was that? To the venomous venomi of the Vilepi. Warning, be careful as that toxic goop kills instantly. Also, watch out for small blue somethings. So, they're bomb bombs. Who would have guessed? Oh, oh, fuck you. Oh, with a giant capital F. Let's grab this. Okay. Oh, and oh, and oh. Good job dying there. Some sort of like acid. Something that I want to be jumping in for certain. Oh, jump over those guys. How do I get that? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Give me some of those. Give me some of these blocks. Get me some of that midpoint. Kinda bellows at my joint. Um how, how did I get hit? Oh well, okay. Never knew that. Never took a guess at that. Oh oh crap. I thought I was a. Oh, I just saw that happen. Why? 
I, I knew that was gonna happen there. I just, I knew it. Oh. You just get so used to jumping on those little shit heads. And then the next moment, I mean, you really don't know what to do. So, we're gonna spin jump on everything. Extremely break the original game of this, where the source material comes from. All in all, though, I do like how this hat is made, though. If you've never been to Super Mario World Central, there are some pretty good games on that site that people have made. I recommend you going there and checking some out if you enjoy these sort of things. And I got 18. Kind of never get the top of the end goal. And we're at the Bramble bonus. Or the Switch Zone. Let's see what the Bramble bonus is. Can you collect all the big coins? Hit the harm block for a bubble boon. Miss it and you can't play. Hit the bubble boon. Okay, I guess since you're nice enough to, um, ask if I can do it, I will do it. Oh my goodness! Haha, <laughs> you see, I had that planned from the beginning. Good job to me. Let's be as arrogantly cocky as possible. Yeah, he's even winking at me. So I'm gonna have to tell him no on that. Switch zone for B. Got some flooded area here. That's kind of dangerous to the workers of this switch palace area. Like, I wouldn't want my job to be compromised by the bursting of my lungs and the taking in of endless water everywhere I see. Of course, I'm not going to be looking for long, because I'm dead. I mean, I don't... I don't know what commission they got this approved with, but, I mean, the Koopas should be forming a union, going on strike, that sort of thing. That's kind of a dick move by Bowser. Oh. And we're moving on to Wanda's castle. Oh. And we got the absolute cutest uh, thwomp I've seen in a while. And another one of those. And the pencil. I'm so glad they made them look like pencils. I mean, everybody always kind of thought that's, you know, what they looked like. Of course, somebody else thought they looked like, uh, someone's body part, and I think you know which one, the original, oh, I did it again, my goodness, and I think you know which one I'm talking about, too, okay, gotta view this objectively. Stop sucking. Okay, I've objectively viewed it. 
Oh my goodness. Staircase from hell. And jumping into that spike for no reason at all. You don't need a reason to do things. If you're chaotic. That just means you like to have some fun, if you know what I mean. And... Show me the money. Okay. Oh my. Did not, did not mean to do that. Stupid missiles in the background there. I just... I just won myself about them, and I'm still getting plastered by them. Oh my goodness, it's just the idea that they can come up and then hit you. Even if you're like standing above them, the idea is that they would come up and ram their head up Mario's ass. That's probably why you get hit if that does happen. A very unpleasant feeling whenever someone's ramming their head up your ass as a male. Something you don't want done to you. And, uh, Soviet space technology? Failed. Wanda Tupa. The spoiled little daughter of Reswab Tupa is defeated. Mario steadily makes his way out to the forest to the next world. Have you got the yellow and blue switches? You're you're a dick if you have not. And here is where I make my end. Good day to you all.